Aí tu quer entrar mexendo. <risos> What the? What? You're gonna tell me that he single and deadly defeated all of these guys? I love the smell of victory in the morning. It smells like sweat. No, no. Oregano. No. Like victory. Yeah, victory. Yeah. Yeah, that's the ticket. <laughs> okay. After a week of traveling, you leave the caravan when it comes within sight of the city of Razir. The caravan masters wa the caravan master warns you that Razir is a dangerous place to be and bids you be wary of all you meet there. He rears up and salutes you, and you watch the caravan move onward into the desert. You ride alone to the entrance of Razir and pass through the bird gates which barely open for you. This seems like a dark place. Yeah. Stay where you are, stranger, or you'll discover how sharp a weapon can be. So you're hard and want to call the hero of Shapir? Well, understand this. We don't need no thinking heroes around here. Do I make myself clear? Do I make myself clear? Stubborn, aren't you? Well, perhaps some time spent in prison will teach you some matters about prison in Razir. You must learn to be orders. See that you obey all the rules posted around town. Rule number one. Strangers must always carry their visa. Do you have your visa? Already breaking the rules, are you? Here is your visa. Don't leave town without it. Kind of a douche, isn't he? Yeah, I think I'm gonna say because I don't feel safe. <laughs> I would call this Welcome to Razir. Right. Welcome to Razir. Not a very nice welcome. Yeah. Okay. So, in the immediate vicinity, there's this place called the Blue Parrot. A blue stallion. Of all the gin drums and all the world, you had to walk into this one. A hush comes over the bar as people notice you and hide you suddenly. Will you look what crawled in from the desert? He has been out in the sun so long his hair has gone yellow. I'm a blonde, you fool. No, no, Wilmer. He is a stranger to our fair city. You won't want to give the wrong opinion about the hospital with him right here. I already have the wrong opinion. Come here, stranger. I see you have already made the acquaintance of Kevin or Hill Street's captain of the Resilient Guard. So perhaps you already have an idea for Resilient Hospitality. Come here, sit down, and let us have a little chat, you and I. Welcome to the Plum Parrot. I am Ferrari, CEO of Ferrari. Sit down, my dear sir. Relax. You're among friends here. If you don't mind me saying so, you look like that. You look like a man with a mission. I like that man. But perhaps a word of caution. In a city such as Razir, there are many deaths to the problems. Do not try to change things here too quickly. We'll find that the system is not so bad once you get used to it. However, it would be very dangerous to try to alter that system. You might make enemies. Enough of such morbid thoughts, though. Perhaps you should, we should share a drink in honor of a new relationship. Would you prefer a Razir coffee or a ginger sling? Which one? Go for your sling. Whatever you wish, man. A wise choice. I dislike a man who doesn't drink. It reveals a distinct lack of trust, and you can trust me, my good sir. Can we? Wilmer, I drink from over for our young friend. Let us drink to our fortunate meeting. Mm. You feel strange for a few seconds, but if anything passes, Ferrari starts to ask you some very probing questions, but you evade most of them. You are a very close mouthed individual. You handle your drink very well. I trust you will handle yourself in Razir as well. 
We will reserve a room here for you tonight. You will need to return here before dark, for it is forbidden to be out at night. Join me this evening and we will talk some more. I have some information which may prove useful to you. I will see you later. I have some thinking to do now. Alright. What do you have to say? That is Senor Ferrari to you, punk. <laughs> Alright. I see. We don't wanna talk. So wasting time in the Razier is extremely boring. Yeah. What time is it? Uh mid afternoon. Okay. Could have been worse, could have been morning. Yeah. That's you must carry your rise at other times. Oh right, I remember that. There's those messages. <laughs> Don't I have my visa? Oh, yes, please. Yes, but uh, I remember this. There's messages shown in the reserve at all times. It's an authoritarian city, so. So it keeps showing? Yeah. That's why I have no choice but to walk since I don't have the map of this place. Oh, the map still works. It does? It does, since it... Uh... While Resident and Repair are supposed to be twin cities, a large part of the city appears to be blocked off. At least you can use the map to see where you are. Wow. That's... Uh... Wow. Yeah. All we can do is go in a circle. Yeah. Remember, Razir and Shapiro are sister cities. Right. Everything that monetary is forbidden? Yep. Look! Some men more, are more involved than others. Oh. I see. The street has been barricaded off. The sign reads, Road closed by order of Kevin. I see this looks like a, a jail or something. The sad thing is we can't even go to bed anymore. Yeah, that's what the thing sucks. And there's literally nothing to do. Pretty much. We can't even leave town to hunt in the desert. Well, uh, as long as we have our visa, yes we can. We can? Yeah. But uh, since we don't have uh, the, uh, the, the means to replenish our supplies... It might be best not to. Yeah, it would be very unwise. I think I should leave here. <laughs> yeah. Another from regard is a rule. So instead of strict names, I get these messages. Yeah. Well, <laughs> the equivalent of Aziza. <laughs> That would be where the astrologer is. Oh. Rules must be obeyed. Follow the system. I try. Man, that's a freaking desert town. Try resting a bit. Yeah. 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 Uh. Why do I keep mixing those up? Continue a bit. Oh, oh. time to go back to the end. Yeah. Oh, I can't. No, you can't fast travel with this map. It will show you where you are, but you can't fast travel.
Where am I actually? Oh, right, left, left. Come to me here, my dear sir, you are still a novelty in Razier, and I take a vested interest in all things new. It is time we discuss some things together, you and I. I wish to tell you a story, a fable that has a moral. How you choose to react to this moral is your own life. As you well know, the old Emir was deposed last year and his brother took over the palace. Razer used to be a place with very few laws and restrictions, a place where the streets were filled with people and merchants and water flowed free from the fountain. That has changed with the coming of Kevin and his master. A new order has been established the week at Marish North Well. <laughs> Only the strong who adapt remain, those that could not adapt were destroyed. You are strong, but it remains to be seen how that bull you are. It would be a great shame for you to wind up in Kevin's dungeons. Enough of that, for now, I have someone I would like you to meet. Ugarte, I would like you to introduce you to Sona. I am very pleased to make your acquaintance, I have heard much about you already. Ugarte here provides an invaluable service to his community, he obtains things for others which are otherwise unattainable. For them enough, of course. It seems he has some information for you. A rumor, perhaps, that may influence your actions. I would be happy to share some information for, say, five dinars? It seems before I give you what you want, you should give me what I want. It is only fair, no? Five dinars, please. Oh. Kevin has sent the word out to his men that you are to be watched at all times. Seems that uh, someone is very interested in your actions. You should be aware that Kevin does not usually greet strangers at the gate. You are expected. Why would he take an interest? There is the little matter of a prophecy to be fulfilled, and this one may be the one. I suspected before that you were a very dangerous man to have around, so that it seems I am correct. Still, it will be very interesting to see how this game plays out. You may say tonight in the first room past the door on the left. I Wanna think... ask something else to you, Garte? You may call me your Garte. I make many things of rumors. This someone told Kevin to watch for you. It is interesting to see Kevin play the lucky around here. Kevin is not the person in charge in Razier, although I would like to be the for you to rise. About that one, I can say no more. It is said that the whisper of his day will draw his attention. I have no wish for him to notice me. It is said that uh, someone is waiting for someone to open a door to something. I have had no desire to learn more about it. Things dealing with magic are best left alone. This is gonna be the same thing. Yep. Wait. Hold on. Something new appeared. Uh, no, I was wrong. We're all friends, are we not, Ferrari? There is much profit to be made here if a man keeps his eyes open for opportunity. It would be hard for someone such as myself to make anything there. So I have heard. There are a few, so few dust to work around. I do what I can to help those poor unfortunates who live around here. Water is my specialty. Since the button is dried up, the only place to get water is from the immersed man. The only place other than myself. That is, it is surprising how much water is worth to one who is thirsty. The new emir is as big as a fool as his brother was. I have heard that he hides in the palace and will not leave his room. The palace of Razier is very lovely and dangerous. All the wealth of Razier remains there and all the dungeons as well. It is said that the only way to leave the Razier's dungeons is to die. 
Since the person does not give water, it stands to reason that someone has to. And you will not believe how much the Himiyo's men charge for water. It is a crime. Fortunately, my prices are much more affordable. Okay, then. So be it. That's it. I click at the same time to set something. Yes, we go in the room. Yep. And we. What the fuck? You slept fitfully, dreaming of rat like monsters pulling at you. In your dream, you felt cruelly exposed, but you recovered. <laughs> yeah. Signor Ferrari sends his regrets, but he had some rather disturbing news. He will talk to you this evening. Just right for a zero day, too. Oh my god, this is gonna be a long one, isn't it? I think it will be. Walk toward the fountain. Let me see. It's just oh. straightforward. That's not hard. Oh! You see several people gathered in the south part of the plaza. This town, you of all men should know that, Ugarte. I know very little. What is going on? I am innocent of any wrongdoing. If you are so innocent, then what is this? I don't know where, how that water bag could have gotten there. Someone must have planted it on me. Where are the skins under your tunic, Ugarte? You know that smuggling water is a crime against the state. You also know what we do to criminals like you. No, no, please. I am innocent. I do not know how it got there. No. Hero, help. This is the fate of anyone who breaks the rules of the city. Remember this and see that you do not suffer the same fate. I hope you are smart enough to learn this lesson. You do not want to see the dungeons of Razir. Okay. Well, we are carrying water. <laughs> yeah, but we don't smuggle it. True. So... No, 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 don't do that, don't do that! Just press OK. I wanted to try something. Oh well. Well, we are that. Don't follow them. Oh. It will be bad for you. Because nothing's happening. I wanna see. I'm curious. Oh. Alright. So. Just go forward. Good morning. Oh my god. Just go forward. Hello? You sent up a doorway. Quickly, before the guards come. Please, you must help me. Take off your clothes. see the city before I am forced to marry Kevin. I have heard you are a hero. With your help, I can be out of the city before nightfall. I wish to disguise myself as you and leave with your visa. So please, let me exchange clothes with you. Uh, wait. Is this? Don't you have an extra set of clothes? 
Yeah, but I'm still gonna lose my visor. Don't have any choice at that point. Where are my clothes? Go down. I think that's... Ah, that's my spare suit. So I guess I could give her this. Yeah. You have another spare change of clothes that Shima packed for you. Thank you so very much. Why was there a wig in there? Hmm? Why did Shima give us a wig? I have no idea. Because how oh, else could she get that? How do I look? Do you think this will fool anybody? It's so nice not to have to wear a stupid veil. Please, in order to leave the city, I need one more thing. Although it would be dangerous for you, I must have your visor. Give it to her, I guess. Thank you ever so much. In return for your favors, I can only give you a token. Here's your, here is my mirror. You have but to show it to any woman in the past and she will heal you. Again, my thanks and my fortune favor you. Farewell. Wait until she clears the other way before you leave, FND. Okay. So that happened. Just wait a bit. Yeah. The girls will be coming soon in search of Zayesha. You must, you must not be seen talking with me, Fendi. It is forbidden. Okay, you can leave now. If you need a place of safety in the palace sometimes, DRM will co welcome you for the hail you gave my mistress. I shall tie a veil from the battle mats at night to guide you. Thank you greatly, Fendi hero. Okay. You must carry your wrist. Yeah. What time is it now? Save. Good afternoon. Okay, it's not that bad. You must carry your visa at all times. So just rest some time. Just rest a bit. Ah, uh, why don't you doing that? Oh, good. Forward. Right. Just to make sure. Yep. Forward. Not as bad as I remember. Maybe this. So the hen? Yeah. It's not as bad as I thought. It is a pity about our friend Yarty, is it, is it not? I can see you are as broken up by the affair as I am. However, it seems he has somewhat the wrong questions about you. There was just a performance put on for your benefit this morning. Kevin has known about Yerti's water smuggling for a long time. As mo a most dangerous man, Kevin. I'm almost as dangerous as you are. I'll go sleep, I guess. No talking with you? Go try, but I guess you won't. Please don't disturb me, I need to think. Alright. Go sleep, I think. <laughs> man, that room sucks. As you enter, the sun's the bar goes still. This can be good. It has been a pleasure to meet you, my dear sir. Huh? Fairly in your view. This doesn't feel good at all. You are under arrest for breaking the law of Razir on this day. The 29 of the serpent, Yar of the Jinn. Come quietly, or you will be taken by force. You briefly consider struggling with the guards, but realize that there are just too many of them. You follow the guards through the dark streets, past the gates of the palace, and into the dungeon of Razir. Hey, it's a Keta! After being dragged to the dungeon of the palace, you are roughly searched, beaten, and questioned by the guards. For one you that Kevin will be coming soon to personally question you. And that you won't enjoy it. Talk to the cat perhaps. The cat just stares suspiciously at you. Okay. 
say something about Shapir? You let it get out about your friendship with his cousin Shima. Of course it's a cousin. What were the odds? Ah, then you are indeed a friend in a place where we both need friends. We need to escape from this prison. Uh, show him, uh, show him the film. And at the end, that's the only thing the guard did not take. We took everything else. Yeah. A pin like that can only be seen by a friend, such as, he, such as it's magic. You must be very trusted by my people to gain such a thing. Well, kind of friend, let us escape this very dangerous place. Well then, cast open on the door. I have heard from others on the other ground that there is a concealed passage in the room outside the cell. Pick up your stuff. Yeah, I was going to. The entrance to the passageway should be here. Yes, it is here. Lend your strong shoulder to the task. I will pick up my stuff, but it's not letting me. I have helped others escape through the triggered passageways. Do not fear, I will lead you to safety through the passageways, get a friend. Perhaps before you leave, you should pick up your equipment over there near the cell. But do not let it too long, or the girls will surely come. You recover all of your equipment. The cat is to you through dark passages under the press to a secret exit into the resi streets. If I understand correctly, you are here to defend that Shapir from those magical elementals and you are now here to liberate a free city. I am impressed by your sense of honor, yet despite your previous heroics, I think you will need assistance taking down the entire resilient regime. I believe you should lay low for now, friend of the Keta. If you are captured again, we will surely kill you on sight. Tomorrow night, the underground will launch an attack on the pass in an attempt to overthrow the Premier. If you can manage to stay out of Kevin's hands for one more day, you will be very capable to ally to us. Okay. Okay. Say goodbye to him, I guess. You are right. Our chances of avoiding capture will be greater if we split up. Do not return to the blue parrot. Those scoundrels will not hesitate to turn you in once if they hear Kevin's is looking for you. Avoid the guards at our coast, as we will soon know of our escape. May you both farewell, hero friend. Because I get the feeling I'm gonna get captured. Hmm. Suicide is punishable by death. Seriously? <laughs> okay. Ignorance of the lies, no excuse. I that makes me wonder, where the hell am I? Ah, uh, okay. Just go forward. Uh, left I <laughs> Just go left. Where should I go? Oh? You faint, you cannot move. The man before you has a low, pleasant voice, and I. Sonic, I am your friend. Remember your friend, Adamis. Why does that name sound familiar? It does. Wait, was, was I not warned of Adamis? Yes, you were. Remember my voice, remember my face. Trust me, I am your friend. You try to struggle, but your body will not obey. Why did that move so fast? I am your friend, and you trust me. Trust in my words, trust in my eyes. Look in my eyes, and trust me. You look at his eyes, and cannot look away. They seem to glow, his words seem to whirl around your head. Sonic, I am your friend. Obey now your friend, Adebis. Obey now my words, obey now my voice. Trust in your friend and obey me. You find yourself relaxing. You are with a friend. His eyes are gentle and his smile warms you. Sonic, you know me. I am your friend, Adavis, who helps you escape from the dungeons of Razir. Together we seek to aid our friend, Emir Aris. I was his trusted vizier. Remember? 
You find yourself nodding at this dumbbell gentleman to end the evil reign of Rehkaveen and restore our friend the Emir Aris. Together we must go out into the desert. We must journey to the Forbidden City and recover the magic item that will break the spell upon the Emir. We need to get the statue of Iblis. The Iblis trigger. Yes, you know this is something you've got to do, but you frown as you remember the statue of Iblis, don't you? It has remarkable powers and can break any spell it touches. We need to take the statue to Arus, our friend. Together, let us save the city of Razir. He puts his arm on your shoulders and you smile. Here is a man of great wisdom that you have trusted and respected, and he needs your help. Didn't Azizur say something about Iblis being the king of the jinns? Something like that. It's not a good thing. Yeah. I think the only good thing here is that I saved. <laughs> <laughs> Together you will save the Emir. You and Elevius will get the statue of Iblis. You there! Try walking to the door now! No! No fool! Blast through it! Oh, get out of the way! You have no idea how or why you got here, but it is nice to be able to help such a nice man. I cannot be mistaken, my translation of the prophecy must be correct. It must be you. Of all the stupid heroes in the world, I am to be cursed with you. Why is wrong? How does it go? For 1000 years and a year, I bliss will be bound. I know that it has been 1001 years to this very day, so that must be correct. Beneath the tombstone of the city that the ones did found, this is the forbidden city, there is no doubt about that. Then comes a hero from the Northland that led into the spear. You are the only hero that I have found recently, it must be you, and I have no doubt you will despair before I am through with you. Passing through the door unopened, that you will find here. The door, Akir's door, why can you not pass through it? When the moonlight shines between the dragon's jaws, and is comfortably and held there be by the scorpion's claws. The moon! It is not due to rise between the two constellations until tomorrow. How can I be wrong? I will not be denied! I cannot be wrong. It did not say 1001 years, and a day, no. But how can the moon be where it cannot be? You, you're the hero. Answer me how the moon can be between the dragon and the scorpion. It's easy, really. It is. How do you put a moon between two drawings on a door? Think carefully. How do you put a moon between two drawings and a door? Go take a look at your inventory. The answer is straight in your face. Straight in my face? How do I put a moon? I wasn't sure at all. Just use it on the moon. Where's the moon? Is it... <coughs> Passing through the door, what is it about the door? Door with stars, constellations, the scorpion and the dragon are on the door. It must be when the moon shines upon the door that you may pass through it. Let me see, where is the moon now? The moon is to the southeast, but the door is facing north. The moonlight will not pass over us enough to cast light upon the door. Why is this happening to me? After all these years of planning, how can so many things go wrong? Well, hero from the Northland, are you super full of majesty that you can move the moon from its orbit and force it to shine to the door? Or are you so strong that you can bend light? What can you say or do that will let you pass through the door? You find you can speak and move your eyes again, but you can't seem to move your legs. Use the mirror on the moon. Where's the- oh, there's the moon! 
You will the mirror out of your pocket and carefully direct the reflected moonlight between the constellations. At last! Now how does the rest of the prophecy go? And at last the hero, he who is behind, shall see. While Iblis rise by the dark one and the light shall flee. By the name of Solomon, so shall this be. Now you know all you need to know. Go in there and bring me the statue of Iblis Trigger.